My name is Tianhan Liu. Uh, I'm a PhD student at Florida State University. My major is physics. Uh, I got my bachelor's degree in physics in China in 2014. And after that, I came to FSU. I always want to do research, and I'm passionate about physics. And you know, for undergraduate study, we usually just study uh, the fundamental things from the textbook. I didn't really have a chance to learn a lot in the real life research. And I'm also curious how this uh, can, how what I learn can be applied uh, into the latest research uh, in, in this world. I'm curious about um, many different things. One thing is research, uh, which I do, I spend most of the time I do in, in my life. Uh, in, in the lab, when you do, every time you make a new device, you probably can discover something new from the device and you try to develop a theory or explain your data. Uh, in research, the accomplishment I'm very proud of is the research I have been doing for my PhD dissertation. It's in the field of molecular spintronics. We study how the chiral molecules, such as DNA and peptide molecules, uh, can inject the spin into semiconductor surface. I do a lot of uh, out, outreach activities because I'm always curious how this, uh, the general people or the young kids, how do they know more about science and how do we um, try to develop the interest or uh, have, them, have more of them do, do science in the future. So we have group meeting in our research group every week. Uh, so the students and professors will take turns to give presentation about their research or the most latest research uh, happening now uh, to the, the big group in condensed matter physics. I did a three-minute thesis competition in 2018 that, that is held by FSU Graduate School. I was a finalist. For that experience, I was uh, very proud because I was very shy uh, talking to people uh, in front of a lot of people before. But that experience gave me the opportunity to present me better and also I'm able to uh, convey my PhD dissertation to the general audience in only three minutes. I would say especially for a PhD study, it's a very long time. If you are really persistent about that and are very sure this is something you want to pursue, then I think you will have uh, the passion and power to overcome this by yourself.